しい学祖四角い空心の隙間埋めるあけぬよりからけよう a l u c a r d family has so many wonderful toys treasures, relics, artifacts Objects of infinite mystery all clasped tightly in their gnarled, undead grasp. Worst of all, Clavis Alucard had no idea what he was trying to seal away, what this beautiful little object could really do. The Keystone. It may be small. But this baby has enough power to construct a phantom field, a whole world of its own. Shame this is just a piece of it. But now that it's in my hot little hands, it'd be a waste not to do something fun with it. Ah, but what? Hmm. Yeah, there's an idea. Why don't I try connecting it to the Takamagahara system? It too has the power to create worlds after all. Yeah, I like the sound of that. No idea if I'll be able to connect them in the first place, but I can give it the old college try. Hmm? My, my, my. Uh oh. <laughs> That shouldn't happen. Oh dear. This is not good. What was that light? Wait, don't tell me I passed out. But what is this place? How'd I even get to wherever here is? Ahem, <coughs> testing. One, two, one, two, mic check. Can everybody hear me? A voice? But from where? Can you hear me? Let's see here. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, and distinguished guests of every stripe, thank you all so much for gathering here today. But let's dispense with the formalities and get right back to the usual. The usual what? The first annual Phantom Field Tag Battle Summit Showdown Orienteering Tournament. Huh? Okay, what? What the hell is going on? What is she even talking about? Before we get started, why don't we go over the rules? The event will take place in the Phantom Field. That's this place. A beautiful tapestry woven of bits and pieces from different universes. So, you'll motor around here completing that most noble of tasks. Stamp collecting. When you collect five stamps, you've officially qualified. The path to the goal shall open before you. And at that goal, a grand power awaits you. Whoever shall obtain this godly power will have the ability to make any one wish come true. But hold those horses now. Only the first team to make it to the goal gets that grand power. That's right, only the champions are worthy. 
So, if you've got a little wish burning a hole in your heart, you know what you've got to do. Collect all the stamps and reach the goal before anyone else can. The first annual Fiery Explosion Phantom Field Stamp Rally begins right now. Uh... Yeah, uh, that didn't help. I found myself in some pretty messed up situations in my life, but this one might be the weirdest of all. But, as weird as it is, I can't just dismiss what she said. Maybe I should get involved in this stamp rally thing. I feel like I did something similar in grade school. Just to recap, though, I'm stuck in some sham of a world, and I'm supposed to collect stamps. Okay, yeah, screw it. This is bullshit. There's gotta be some non-stampy way to get home. What's this? Is that a complaint I hear on the wind? You know if you had any questions, you could have just asked. You're that stupid voice from earlier. Uh, wow, rude much? The name's not stupid voice, okay? It's, uh, well, just call me System. System, huh? Fine. I'll call you whatever you want, if you answer my questions. First off, where am I? This is the Phantom Field. A temporary realm made up of a little of this and a little of that from a smorgasbord of other realms. Or something like that anyway, that's about the gist of it. That's not even an answer. Whatever. Next up, who the hell are you? I literally just told you. System, remember? I'm the one behind the whole tournament. By the way, is this really the best use of your time? You just want to stick around here asking me random questions? The other contestants are already headed to the checkpoints to get those stamps. So, the checkpoints are where I get the stamps, then. Whose stupid idea was... Time out. You said other contestants? You're not the sharpest crayon in the box, are ya? Why would I hold a stamp rally with only one competitor? Of course there are other contestants, bleh! First off, ouch. And second, who are these contestants? I can't leak that info. That'd just be unfair. But I'm sure you'll come across them eventually. Ooh, in fact, here's one now. Look, Minerva, we made it out. I knew we were going the right way. here! Hello there! Uh, um, hi. Who are you? My name is Celica. Celica A. Mercury. And this is Minerva. We're looking for stamps for the stamp rally. And you are? Damn. I can't believe I've already run into someone taking this stamp nonsense seriously. I'm now Tokurogane. If you're looking for stamps, you're not gonna find any around here. And not to be rude, but do you really buy this collect five stamps and make your dreams come true stuff? Huh? Yeah, of course I do. How else are we supposed to return to our original worlds? Return to our what now? Oh, do you know another way back? I don't... Uh, hey, System! You didn't mention that winning this thing was our only way home. Oh, I didn't? I mean, I can't say for sure that there aren't other ways to get home, but... I'm certainly not aware of any. That being the case, I thought that stamp collecting would be the easiest way to get back to my world. Hard to argue with that. But if we're all so set on getting home, 
Why bother with all this? Won't someone else just wish us all home if we sit around and wait? Oh, come on, don't be so passive. You're young! Show me that wild ambition! Grab life by the horns! Fine then, just this once, I'll send life charging at you. Get on out here, bloodthirsties! Uh. I'll mess you all up! I shall devour everything! Mm, certainly gave him the right name. My! What incredibly fortuitous timing! Um, are these people contestants like we are? Yep, just plucked them randomly from their world. I don't think they would have joined the Stampathon if I asked. Ha! <laughs> you got me fighting little brats again? As long as I get to tear them apart, I don't care who I'm up against. Agreed. As long as my hunger is sated, the quality of the quarry does not matter. Damn, these guys don't look friendly. I know, right? They're so angry and spooky. But I guess if you're just gonna sit around and let them take hold of the grand power, so be it. That sounds a little frightening. Ugh, blah, 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 blah. You're all so damn annoying. Guess I better shut you up permanently. You cannot run. I will not miss the chance to dine on prey from another world. Huh? Is he talking about us? Okay, just hold up. Why are you threatening us? We don't have any stamps or anything. Do I look like I care? Stamps and checkpoints don't mean shit to me. All I gotta do is kill every goddamn one of you, and this stupid bullshit will be done. You don't have any problems with that, do ya? <laughs> what the? Yeah, this man clearly does not respect the sanctity of stamp collecting. What did I tell you? There's no reasoning with violent folks like them. Alas. Anyway, have fun beating each other up. You're the one with the problem here. Yes, we're doing this. Stand back, Celica. No, I'm fighting too. You don't have to worry. Minerva is really strong. Minerva? You mean that robot? Not gonna lie, I wouldn't want to mess with her. The time for deliberations is over, and the time for the feast is nigh. I can only contain myself for so long before such appetizing prey. Listen, asshole, they're mine. If you try and eat them, I'll eat you. <laughs> Things are getting spicy. Good. A stamp rally calls for battle, and a battle calls for tag battle. Let your inner desires run rampant and fight to the death, brave warriors! Tag battle, start! Get ready! Get ready! Can't escape from crossing fate! Fight!
<laughs> That's good, brats. Show me how you squirm. Fascinating. Your fear only makes you more attractive prey. Now, Toe, are you okay? This isn't good. I don't think I can stop them. Hmm. So that's how it is, is it? I thought this might happen, but not exactly like this. Don't give up yet! I still want to hear you scream! <laughs> you want to end this? Then let's end this! Okay, stop right there. Fun time's over. What? What the f- Uh, what now? Everything looks completely different. Did we teleport? Something like that. Oh, but don't get used to it, okay? I can't just whisk people around all willy-nilly. I see. Well, thank you for saving us. That could have gotten really ugly. What? Don't thank her. She's the reason we're in this mess in the first place. I mean, what are you after, anyway? Weren't you just telling us to beat each other up? Please. It's just a figure of speech. If you took it seriously, that's on you. I was only trying to motivate the two of you. Yes, that's right. That's exactly what I was doing, and I only did it out of love. Oh, that makes sense now. No, it does not. Stop believing her. Anyway, do you get it now? You have no choice but to participate in this tournament. Can't you just accept that and move along? I'm a busy system. Places to go, tag battles to arrange. In fact, I'm afraid I must excuse myself. You're on your own from now on, so good luck. What? Hey, wait! I've got so much more I need to ask! You... I think she's gone. And I still have no idea what the hell is going on. Um, I don't really get it either, but... Since we don't know what to do, why not try and find the checkpoints with Minerva and me? We might find a clue along the way. Besides, three heads are safer than one, right? You're one hell of an optimist. Am I? I never thought about it. Well, whatever. I don't like the idea of playing along with System. But we're not gonna solve anything by moping around here. Besides, if the other contestants are anything like the freaks we faced earlier, we've gotta make sure nobody else gets their hands on that grand power she mentioned. So, Celica, Minerva, count me in. Yeah, glad to have you, Naoto. Okay then, shall we get going? You bet. Lead the way, Celica. She's gone. Ah, damn it. Where did that Celica girl run off to? No, I can't blame her. It's my fault for losing track of her. But still, how did she disappear so fast? I looked away for like a second and poof, she's gone in the blink of an eye. Is this some kind of magic trick? Hey! Celica! Where are you? 
And where the hell am I for that matter? And now I'm somewhere else, apparently. What is this anyway? It definitely stands out. Is it an entrance to something? Could it be some sort of maze? I've seen stuff like this at amusement parks. You've made it at last, brave young challenger. Whoa! Don't scare me like that! Wait, challenger? Yes, indeed. You're going to challenge this maze, aren't you? After all, this is one of our checkpoints. And at the very end of this maze lies, what else? The very stamp you've been searching for. But there's only one, so first come, first serve. Oh, right, the stamp thing. I really thought that was an excuse just to get us fighting. Maybe that means Celica's here, too. She did say we were headed for the checkpoints, after all. Oh, yeah? Well, it's good to be optimistic. Keep it up and it'll take you far. Buzz off. It's not like you're gonna answer any of my questions anyway, right? That's right, I am but a mere facilitator. I have no choice but to stay in my lane. So, let's get this show started! Naoto Kuragane's Maze Challenge begins now! To the farthest ends of the labyrinth with you! All right, let's get this maze done. How did she get me so fired up? Uh... I'm lost. Damn it. What the hell am I even doing? First I lost Celica, now I'm lost in a maze. Guess I'm in a lose-lose situation. At this rate, who knows when I'll find Celica? Huh? <sighs> that looked like a girl just now. I think I saw a ponytail too. Was that Celica? I knew she'd be here! Good. Now we can group back up and get the hell out of here. Hey! Wait up, Celica! I finally... Hmm? Found... you... Uh, me? Sorry, were you talking to me? Uh... Uh, sorry. Uh, wrong person. Uh, anyway, goodbye. Not so fast. What the? Listen, lad. You've got something on your mind, don't you? Huh? No, I'm just... Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh, no point in hiding it. I'm too nosy not to see it anyway. I see those sad puppy dog eyes. Something is eating you, all right. Come on, you can tell me. Big Sis will make everything all better if you just let it out. No, oh, you're too close. Way too close. Pushed a little too far, huh? Sorry about that. You just look like so much fun to tease, especially since you're the first contestant I've met. So, you're here looking for the checkpoint too? I wouldn't be hanging out in this maze if I weren't. But this is pretty exciting though, right? I mean, the lady did basically describe this as orienteering. Exciting? Lots of optimists around here. Well, what's the point of being pessimistic? Anyway, what's your story? You rolled up in all this crazy stamp stuff, too? Well, that's part of it. But I also lost my companion on the way here. 
Oh, so that's who you mistook me for. In that case, why don't we join up for a while? Work together to find the checkpoint. Oh, yeah? All right, since I already looked that away, let's try going over there. Hey, slow down. I never agreed to any of this. Don't worry. You're gonna have to find the checkpoint to find your friend anyway, right? I... yeah, I guess you're right, but... Then that settles it. We'll search for it together. As they say, in traveling, a companion, in life, compassion. Plus, I can't just leave you on your own in here. You remind me of someone I know. Oh, by the way, what's your name? I'm Yuzuriha. Naoto. Naoto. Okay, got it. All right, now, now, come along. It's time for our date. D date? Hey, let go of my arm! Finally, we made it through. Uh, didn't we? Yang, look. Oh, there it is. This has to be the checkpoint. Which means this must be the stamp. Or the stamps. There are two of them here. That was one irritating maze. It took us way more time than I thought it would. Oh, come on. We had it beat. Got ourselves a couple of stamps, too. <sighs> I guess you're right, but... <sighs> Yang, I hear something. What is it? Huh, I hear it now too. Is it coming from the maze? Is it just me or is it getting closer? Hey, yeah! What? That samurai just burst out of the wall! And here we are! Man, are my senses sharp! Ha! Uh... Was I right or was I right? I told you it'd be faster to just cut our way through the maze. Are you completely crazy? Oh, please. What's got you so uptight? Don't tell me our date was too wild for ya. I was fine until you started swinging that giant katana around. One wrong move and our date would have turned into a crime scene. Aw, don't be like that. Anyway, who are you guys? You taking on the maze like we are? Well, we did just get through that maze, but... We definitely didn't do it the same way you did. Clearly not. If we're all in the same predicament here, then we can skip the formalities. That's a stamp we're all after, right? Looks like it. We just found it before you busted in. You hear that now, now? It seems we've reached our goal. Well, look at that. I'm not completely sold on your methods, but I have to admit, they get results. Um, sorry to butt in. You again? What do you want now? Oh, nothing. It's just that I've neglected to tell you one important little detail. Huh? What detail? Each stamp can only be used once. Excuse me? So any stamps you find at a checkpoint are one and done. Stamp them once and you can't stamp them again. I take it these aren't special multi-use stamps we're looking at. You heard me. You're only getting one use out of each stamp. Huh. Hmm. 
So, now what? Well, now it seems... They have to have a debate. <laughs> I like that. Debate. I'll warn you now, though. If Beacon had a debate club, I'd be president. Ugh, you just can't help yourself, can you, Yang? Still, that is probably the fastest way to sort this out. Wait, wait! I think I just realized what you meant by debate, and... Fear not, young man! There's more to me than just my astonishing beauty. I'll keep you safe. I never asked you to! Anyway, seriously, let's all take a deep breath and talk this over, like grown-ups. We've just met, so why don't we... All right, let's do this thing! Our adolescent rendezvous is now underway. Surrounded by beauties on every side, will the young man pursue love or continue to chase his dream? Our tag battle begins beneath a moonlit sky, but in the end, who will prevail? Somebody please listen to me! Get ready! Get ready! Can't escape from crossing fate! Fight! <laughs> so strong. Is everyone in this world a badass? <sighs> Not bad, you two. If things keep up like this, we'll never settle the score. You've pushed me into a corner. I've got no other choice. Ooh, look at that big pile of stamps over there. What a steal. Now, now, go get it. I'll cover you. Huh? I didn't see any... Huh? Wait, seriously? Where? There's my opening! The stamps are mine! No! What? Hey, no fair! Here's your stamp now, now. Hey, what are you... And one for me! Stamped! Oh no! She used them both! Alright, mission complete. Time for me to skedaddle on out of here. See you now now. It was short, but sweet. Take me out on another date sometime. Hold on! Get back here! Man, she moves fast. <laughs> um, hello, ladies. Hey, Yang, are you thinking what I'm thinking? Couldn't bear another day without you in it. Yeah, Blake. I'm pretty sure I am. Unfortunately, these stamps are useless now. If only we knew someone who had a pre-stamped card. Hmm. Um, well, uh, let's not be too hasty here. I, I mean, that really was a dirty trick on that girl's part, right? Totally not fair at all. But if you think about it, it really didn't have anything to do with me. In fact, you might even say I'm also a victim here. 
Uh, oh, and I just remembered, I haven't even gotten your names. I'm Naoto. Naoto Korganic. I see. Nice to meet you, Naoto. And good night. needs to put up some signs or something. Don't worry, Minerva. Sure, we got separated, but we'll find Nauto sooner or later. I'm starting to get a little tired, though. The walk through the city was bad enough, but then we had to pass through that strange school and... Well, I don't have to tell you, we went all over the place. I hope we can find somewhere to rest. Oh, look, Minerva! A place to rest! No way! It's a house made of sweets! It's like something out of a fairy tale! But that can't be real, right? <laughs> Let's go and check it out anyway. It might be a fancy-looking cafe or something. Having tea in an adorable place like this would definitely wipe away my exhaustion. see why you'd be in that headspace. Right? I mean, look at this place. I thought it'd just be the outside covered in treats, but the inside's full of them, too! This table is a biscuit, and the chair is chocolate! The lamps are candy! These cushions are macarons, too! Oh, wow! This cup is made of the puffy parts of a cream puff! How cool! But it seems like all of these are fake. Take a look at this. A menu? Wait, no, these are instructions. That's right. Apparently, this is another checkpoint. And the only way to clear it is... <gasps> to eat the real treat inside this building. The real treat, huh? Now I get it. The furniture and dishware here all look like treats, but they're all fake. Which means somewhere in this little house is a real edible treat. My thoughts exactly! I was just about to start looking when you showed up. If you want, we can search for it together. Oh, I'm Heart I know, by the way. Nice to meet you. I'm Celica, and this is Minerva. This sounds like fun! Let's find that real treat together. Alrighty, let's check this area out first. Right. Minerva, tell me if you see anything that looks real, okay? into these. This isn't it either. Hmm. Maybe it's not in this area at all. Hey, what's through that door anyway? Whoa, a kitchen! Wow! It looks so professional. And so cute! There's a complete set of cookware here. They've even got flour! Wheat flour. It looks real, sure. But they wouldn't want us to eat this, would they? Maybe that's exactly what they want! 
Maybe we're supposed to make a cake out of it. That would definitely be a real treat. Oh, you're right. Let's see if they gave us the other ingredients, too. Hmm. They've got so many cooking utensils in here. Hmm? The smell. you can tell they're candy, but from afar, they look just like your everyday measuring spoons. What a cute challenge! It really is! But I'm almost disappointed. I thought we'd get to make a cake in this adorable kitchen! Me too. But I'm still glad we found the real treat. Or treats, I guess. Since they're measuring spoons, we've got three. Small, medium, and large. Oh, why don't we brew some tea and enjoy our sweet reward? Tickling my nostrils. That sweet scent. The sweet smell of chocolate. You better hand over every last candy you got, or I'm gonna beat your asses! Wait, huh? Wait, please! I'm done with waiting! Both Luna and Senna are starving! Starving? No, no, nah, uh no. You guys were just about to forget about me to dote on her. And I'm not gonna let that happen. Listen to my story! I found <gasps> ourselves in this strange and unfamiliar land, roped into this strange stamp rally against my will without so much as a word of guidance. And no matter how far I traveled, I didn't see the faintest hint of any stamps. What's worse, my best friend slash fifth executor is nowhere to be found! After hours in this unfriendly world's whirling winds, my stomach grew empty. And as it shriveled, my mind and body shriveled with it. So there I am, at death's door. I catch a whiff of an all-too-familiar scent. I raise my head, and before my eyes appears a heaven-sent gift. A house entirely made of candy. Candy, I tell you! But it was all a lie. Everything inside is fake. Not a single morsel in here is edible. This is a con job. A sham. What do they think I am, stupid or something? Give me chocolate. Give me... You heard her. Hand over the chocolate. They may be small, but those spoons are edible, right? I don't care what they are! Just give me the treats! Otherwise, you're not gonna like the tricks we've got up our sleeves. That's enough! That actually scared me. Ha! Come on out, evil presence! Sh show yourself! Don't go into battle just yet. Oh, my system. Hello. Huh? You again? You better stay out of this or you'll be Luna's second course. I certainly will not stay out of this. I cannot permit such a frankly absurd battle to take place. Y you mean you're here to protect us, system? This thing always shows up when we need it least. Just how much money do you think I put into building this house of sweets? Huh? Huh? 
Look, I'm already working on a pretty low budget here. If you broke something, I'd hold it against you for the rest of your life. So, if you're gonna smack each other around, do it somewhere else. In fact, I'll set you up a proper battle right now. Chocolate's all mine! Without any further ado, fighters ready! Tag battle, engage! Get ready! Get ready! Can't escape from crossing fate! trouble they caused but it is true that we're starving if you're not the kind of cruel stingy heartless gluttonous people who would deny starving children so much as a piece of candy then please could you spare us some chocolate well if you're that hungry I'd feel bad if I didn't at least Sugar, eggs, butter, milk? Yeah, it's all here! Hey, um, Luna and Mika? Hmm? I'm Senna, by the way. Oh, and Senna! Think you can hang tight just a bit longer? If you can, I'll make pancakes! be way more filling than a bite of chocolate ever could. You won't be hungry for long. What do you say? I say yes! Pancakes for Luna and only Luna. Hey, Mika, why don't you go munch on that puny chocolate spoon? The pancakes are mine. What did you say? I want pancakes too. Oh, please, please, please. Pancakes, pancakes, pancakes. Calm down, you two! We have enough pancakes to go around. Both of you can eat till you're full. All right, time to get cooking. A whole bunch of pancakes coming right up! Dessert is served! Oh, just look at them! Mmm, they look so appetizing and smell even better. And that golden color, it's like the most beautiful sparkly treasure I've ever seen. Let's dig in. They're so good. 
It's like the flavor is melting my cheeks off and blasting through my entire body! I'm glad you're enjoying them. Celica, should we dig in too? Oh, that's right! The chocolate spoons! Yeah! Let's eat! Let's eat! This should get us our stamp, right? I think so. Hey! I want seconds! You got any more? Ooh! I want seconds, too! That was quick. The other ones are still cooking, so just wait a second. Maybe we should bring out more frying pans. More pancakes coming right up! Oh, that was another nasty shake. Well, are you at your wit's end yet? Oh, I jumped off my wit's end a few hours ago. How was I supposed to see any of this coming? This was not in the job description. Yes, yes, I feel your pain. But the sad truth of this world is that you can't always get what you want. Particularly in this job. Says the one making everything worse. Come now. Can't a guy express a little concern for a dear friend? I'm just trying to be nice. Take some of that massive mental burden off of you. After all, if you collapse under its weight, everything else might collapse with you. Might, he says. You really don't know what you're dealing with, do you? That power is not to be taken lightly. I'm well aware of that, which is why I'm trying to prevent... <sighs> Dear me, it seems like we don't have much room to play around here. I can only contain you-know-what for so long! Are you sure they'll make it? Not at all, but if they don't, we'll be in big trouble. And it can't just be anybody. It has to be someone who can withstand the power of a god. Otherwise, this is all going straight into the trash. While it may look like a silly little game, it's our best way to filter out the candidates. By the way, it seems two of our contestants are from worlds we haven't seen the likes of before. So, can I leave the rest of this up to you, then? But of course! Honestly, it doesn't look like you have much choice. I'll take care of everything. <laughs> 